All this month, get any smartphone 32 gig and under for 50% off regular price at Appalachian Wireless. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. While supplies last, two-year agreement required. Late Saturday night or early Sunday morning, someone entered the Tug Valley Country Club golf course and vandalized the property. According to officials, someone drove a vehicle onto the number six green at the golf course and caused between twenty and thirty thousand dollars worth of damage. Those working at the golf course work strictly as volunteers and say money earned at the golf course is used to pay utilities and some maintenance work if needed. They say the money for repairs will be hard to come by. Our whole goal is to keep this facility open. We have to have money to keep it open. We have bills just like everyone has. But we have to have greens that are puttable. People won't play golf if you don't have greens that are puttable. Officials say this isn't the first time the Tug Valley Country Club has been subjected to vandalism. A little over four years ago, someone took an ATV on a similar joyride. However, officials add this is the first time a full-size vehicle was used. When you're talking about four-wheelers, you're talking about kids and young adults that would do that kind of damage. But uh, this is the first time we've had this kind of damage on the West Virginia side of the river because it's open. You know, I mean, people are driving up and down the road all hours of the day and night. Officials are hoping since the golf course is located so close to the highway, someone may have seen something that could help them find the perpetrators. If you have any information, contact the Mingo County Sheriff's Department. Callers may remain anonymous. Reporting in Sprig for EKB News, I'm Shelby Steele.